So, hello, I'm going to do a really quick tutorial on desktop defaults. So when you first come up to the iMacs, they're going to look somewhat like this. This is my computer, so it looks a little different, but they look somewhat like this. And so what you, one of the first things you want to do is you want to go to the Finder, Preferences, and from Preferences on the General, you want to turn on Hard Disks, in connected servers because that will show you show the disk over here it'll be yours will have a number but that will show your main disk and then down here it'll probably be on all my files and what you want to turn the to is your home directory in this case it's my home directory but in the case of your login it would be IMS and have that little home icon and turn it on that and so new finder windows will start at the home position then go to sidebar and to kind of clean up the sidebar we rarely use all my files because of the shared server you don't have a cloud you don't need iDrop applications you leave desktop you leave documents you leave downloads you leave movies music pictures I take off because we're not typically using those on our labs uh, back to my Mac you don't need connected servers you leave on Bonjour computers you don't need and then I turn on devices for hard disks. Um, you can leave CDs, DVDs, and iPods on. And I don't typically use tags, so I don't turn tags on. If you're in the habit of tagging and utilizing tags, then you can come in here and turn that on. Then the next thing you want to do is you want to go over to the Apple icon down to System Preferences and bring up System Preferences and start at the mouse. And what you want to do is turn on the right click so you turn to secondary button here so you have primary button on the left side and secondary button on the right hand side and this little gridded pattern you go there and that takes you back to all and then we're going to go to the desktop screensaver solid colors gray finally we have the dock which we can um, automatically hide and show turn on or off I prefer to have that automatically hide and show the dock turned on so that the dock won't come until I drag down to it. But if you want to set the dock up initially, you can turn that off in systems and then drag the piece, the, the icons to the dock that you like if you use dock as opposed to keyboard equivalents or menu access. Um, it, there's a picture a graphic loaded into canvas that gives you a standard dock setup that you can use this is just the the dock that is set on my laptop one final note about desktop setup think of the desktop as a temporary storage space don't get in the habit of leaving things on the desktop it's fine to store stuff to the desktop on a temporary may mode but when you get ready to leave and log out of the lab make sure that you move anything that's on your desktop that belongs to you either to the trash or to a folder or to a thumb drive or an external drive so that when you log in this is the screen you should see basically gray icon ready to go okay hope that helped <laughs>